I'm off to better things. I'm only doing shit that's gonna make me elevate me better. In that Hi everyone, it's Ariel here and welcome back to my channel today. I'm so excited because I'm going to be doing another furniture vlog. This vlog is kind of hectic. I got so many different pieces of furniture and you guys will see just going through my process with trying to figure out organizing and all that kind of stuff. I still am. So this is kind of going to be a series on my channel going further with more furniture vlogs and I'm going to do like an organization series. So stay tuned. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up to let me know how you like it. It also helps me and my channel out a lot. Also, be sure to comment down below. I love having conversations with you guys in the comments. And if you're not subscribed already, please be sure to do so. It is such a fun time around here and I would absolutely love it if you stuck around. But without further ado, I think we're starting with the clips that I got my bed. So that was actually about a few weeks ago already. So I've been compiling these clips over the past few weeks. So let's just get right into it. Another day and more furniture so this is my bed i got it on offer up this is my first time ordering anything from offer up so if everything goes smoothly i want to order my couch from offer up but i don't know the thought of not being able to try it first kind of i don't know but anyway i'm gonna open this box up right now and i'm gonna try and set this up by myself we'll see how it goes and the reason i'm doing it by myself is because it's 3 a.m and i am so eager to set this up like i literally cannot wait like i've been waiting for a few days already Ready. So I needed my man's help because his family had a minivan so it's been sitting in the minivan for a few days and I'm just so eager you know when you buy something and you're like I need to set it up right now that's me I'm setting it up right now or at least attempting you know I'll be satisfied if I open it and I see it and you know if it's not going too smoothly I'll go to bed and try again tomorrow we got this bed pushed up against the wall for now I'm gonna take this apart I'm actually gonna try and ship the mattress to my brother in new york i'm gonna have to try and like vacuum it all that extra stuff but i'm gonna vlog kind of the process for you guys a little bit i'm also trying to get this done as quickly as possible so i can sleep another reason that i want to do this right now is because the faster i get this done the faster i could put the mattress on it and the mattress is memory foam and it needs to expand for 24 hours so i want to be able to sleep on it tomorrow and i don't want to wait till tomorrow morning because then i have to wait till the next morning so anyway okay guys so the reveal i just looked at it right now it's so pretty hold on look how pretty it is so the camera it's really bad lighting right now so it looks kind of dark but this nice white color with these crystals it actually looks the identical if not a little better than the pictures but yay okay so here's the low mattress this is the size comparison it's insane everything's a mess right now the bed is way too complicated so i will talk to you guys tomorrow morning when we figure this out but we're gonna just leave it to expand since it's supposed to expand okay so it's the morning the bed's inflating really nicely and it's time to set it up i'm really excited because everything's a mess right now and i can't wait to be done so I could work that out but jbw sent me some roses i also got a bunch of other stuff that i'm going to show you guys later in this vlog but they've been in the box since yesterday so i'm going to set these up right now thank you so much so i set them up they look so stunning they Thank you to JBW watches. So this is what it's looking like right now. Right now I'm gonna clean the headboard. Okay, so it looks so good. Here's some perspective. Sorry, everything's literally a mess. I have to clean everything out right now. This stuff was all under the old bed, so I'm waiting until I get my dresser soon. And yeah, it's so pretty. Excuse the wrinkly sheet, but I'm excited. I'm gonna go about the rest of my day and really clean and organize and put things away, and I'll talk to you guys later. Hi, my love. So I'm bare face. I look exhausted. My dark circles have been extra bad lately. I need to fix my sleeping schedule, but I'm about to leave. I'm doing a brand campaign shoot, and I'm not sure. How much i'm able to show or if i'm able to tell you guys the brand or anything so i'm just gonna bring my phone and maybe get some footage and some stories but i just wanted to vlog i'm really excited i'm a little nervous because it's been so long and like with covid and everything the precautions are going to be a little bit different and i haven't done a campaign shoot in a cool minute so I'm a little nervous but i'm gonna get my hair and makeup done and everything so maybe i can film that part 
I don't really know, but I did want to document this in the vlog. Yes. So hair and makeup is done. I love how natural and pretty it looks. Now we got some bathing suits. But yeah, I love it. And I'll link the makeup artist here and down below. So these are more candies from Goopsterlandia. I'm gonna have their at name on the screen and down below. These look so bomb. They ran out of stickers, um, but I told them it's fine because I was craving the candy. These are watermelon sour patch. I'm not sure what these are. They look bomb though. Peach rings. These are blue raspberry sours. Excuse my crusty nails. Um, these are gummy worms. Oh my god, sour patch kids. These are gushers. These are sour octopus, sour belts gummy bears mangoes and other rings oh my god they all look so delicious i can't wait thank you so here is my little furniture aaron's running off of the day it's finally time to get all this stuff out of here i'm shipping this to my brother in new york um it's been a struggle but um i have to buy like ratchet straps and try to tie it down to fit in the box this is my old mattress and yeah so i'm just a bare face right now um gonna go to a bunch of different stores ross home goods tj Maxx. Marshalls, Ikea, Container Store. I'm just gonna be running all over the place. Today, I ordered my jewelry organization mirror, which I'm gonna vlog everything, and my entry table. And then at Ikea, I'm gonna go pick up the dresser. Everything else that I wanna get at Ikea is sold out right now, so I'm just gonna look for like decoration, just a bunch of other stuff and like kitchen organization, basically everything like that. The couch is back ordered. I'm gonna get it on offer up. The lady said she's gonna call me next week because she's gonna order it next week. And and then deliver so yeah kind of everything's gonna be a slow process but i'll bring you guys along so over here at ikea we've been running around all day i'm sorry i totally forgot to vlog because i've been so focused on like looking at all the furniture in the stores and getting ideas and stuff nothing quite exciting so don't worry but i'll try and vlog when we go to the other places right now we got my dresser the more you know y'all i didn't know that my car seats went back but Perfect fit. Excuse my appearance, but now I'm gonna run to Home Goods and TJ Maxx and Marshalls just to check out like lamps and stuff and get ideas for rugs and everything. It's already eight, so hopefully I'll be home by like 9:30 ish because I have homework to do tonight. But I've been anticipating this for the longest that I'm like I don't even. It's fine. The homework can wait. <laughs> okay, so I'm at Home Goods. This mask, by the way, how cute is it? From Get Stone. Um, but yeah, I'm just browsing. I want to get plants like this, but I feel like these are the final stuff. Like. I'm so quick to jump to all the decorations. But I haven't even got all the furniture yet, so it's like I need to picture everything first. Okay, so pillows. And then I found the cutest thing ever for my dresser. Oh my god, it's like a lazy Susan. I love it. Okay, guys, so I am home and it was a little late and I had to do homework. And we couldn't find the little bellhop that helps like transport the boxes upstairs to the elevator. So we're gonna um, end up looking for that tomorrow to take the stuff upstairs and set it up tomorrow. And then tomorrow is another long fill day but I wanted to update you guys in terms of where I'm getting my other furniture so I've been shopping a lot on Wayfair I actually ordered quite a few things none of it has come yet but Wayfair is it and the way I've been organizing everything I'm not going to show you guys because I have like my personal budgeting in there but basically just imagine I have like couch coffee table rug blah 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 and then I have my budgets for all of them and like I said guys I'm buying everything from scratch I'm seeing it I as an investment I want to treat myself you know I have this apartment my apartment has been so unorganized and it just hasn't really felt super homey lately because I just feel like I need all my furniture and I want to decorate it the way I want and you know furniture really is an investment and I feel like the furniture oh my god I look horrible hey it's reality I've been doing homework don't mind me but I feel like you really have to invest I feel like once I get all this furniture and organization out the way it's gonna improve my life so much to be able to have a routine I need to organize my makeup finally i need to organize my dresser finally so i'm gonna vlog all of the processes for everything i'm not even sure how i'm gonna divide these vlogs up i'm just kind of filming and going with it and seeing what comes when but a lot of things are going to be shipping and coming at different times throughout the month which is actually a good thing because i have time to focus on little sections at a time and i hope by april 1st all my furniture can be done and most of the stuff can be organized and out the way 
so I can start creating routines for myself. I'm feeling really stagnant with life, to be honest. And yeah, so right now I'm actually about to edit some videos and stuff and plan um, some content. And yeah, it's a stressful process, but we're going to get it done. And I'm hoping by the first week of April because then I'll have two months to, you know, look for jobs. If you guys didn't know, you can watch um, a few of my past videos. I'm going to start looking for job options for after college. And I'm also looking into some other fun and exciting ventures, but I need to focus on that stuff. So I need to get all this stuff out of the way and I'm actually really excited. So yeah, I will keep you guys updated along the way. Hey guys, so I just finished filming a video. Sorry, I'm starving, but I just finished filming a video at Starbucks, which probably will already be up by the time you watch this. And I finished filming a makeup tutorial, so I'm proud. I'm actually going to go home and upload this Starbucks video. But I just got my jewelry organizer in the mail, and I'm so freaking excited. You guys don't even know. So I ordered this off Amazon. I was going back and forth through Wayfair, Amazon, looking at a ton of different jewelry organizers. I knew I wanted like one of those Amour things. Uh, I don't really have, I mean I have the space and then I don't because you guys will see once my bedroom is finished. Right now I have my bed, I have the vanity, I have my dresser which I'm actually so bummed out by the way because we bought the dresser the other day, but we need a drill and it's fine because my boyfriend has one at his house that he can borrow and bring back, but that's going to take a few days. So I'm a little sad, a little stressed because when I tell you guys my room and my dresser situation is a mess, it is a mess. So I'll show you guys when I get home, but I had under the bed organizers from my last bed that I kept a lot of my um, jeans, sweatpants, things like that in, and also some shoes. So right now that's all stacked on the side of my room, which I'm going to try and organize because even though I can't set up the dresser for a few days, at least I can try and organize a few of this stuff. My closet's pretty much good to go like hanging wise, but I want to do a whole separate video on my closet and how I organize that. So I need to figure out, but I have also little pouches that you guys will see that I kept put PJs in and stuff like that and all of that I want to put in the dresser. But anyway, back to what I was saying, my jewelry thing came today. So I knew I wanted to get like over the door one and I knew I wanted to get a mirror one like they have the mirrors that open that have the jewelry thing I've always wanted one of those and I don't know why I've never got one back home in New York me and my mom kind of shared a jewelry collection and I had that on top of like a little cubicle that I had so that worked out fine but wait till you guys see where I keep all of my jewelry at and I never wear jewelry anymore because you guys will see why when we get home but I'm gonna set that up today so that's exciting at least hopefully everything goes smoothly with that and I can start putting my jewelry in there and and then little by little but right now I'm gonna go pick up my bands and we're gonna go to Home Depot because I need to pick up ratchet straps because I'm gonna ship the mattress my old mattress to my brother in New York why am I holding this up like is this is a Starbucks sponsorship Starbucks if you want to I will gladly take it but anyway um, I need to get ratchet straps and I want to look at their dresser wood tabletops because my Ikea one is old. I have to cut that. Nobody will cut it. I can't find a store that will cut it. Every wood shop is like, you got to buy the wood from us. Hopefully Home Depot has like a white thing of wood that I can get cut down. I'm doing a lot of blabbering here. I have to get on the mode of vlogging more. Kind of lost my touch, but we're going to go ahead and do that. So far it looks good. So this thing came with a huge crack in the mirror and then there's scratches all over it one big one here so this is just really upset because everything is not going my way let's just say that i told you guys already about the dresser and i was excited to come home and set this up at least but now i gotta freaking return this lug this to a ups store and hopefully they get it back to them soon so i can get a refund and i can get the other one because this is just getting a bit ridiculous good news is that i got word that my couch actually just after i talked to you guys i got news back on my couch that it's gonna come sunday so <laughs> hopefully you know it's just gonna be a struggle you know i spent the money but unfortunately this stuff ain't gonna come for a minute so yeah i had the option of completely getting this replaced but i feel like i don't want to deal with another one coming replaced and i feel like it's just a sign plus this is supposed to be white and it's kind of ugly on the sides so i think i'm just gonna order the one that i originally wanted and see how that turns out i'm just gonna put this back in here 
and then I'm gonna try and do the mattress and everything I don't know I think the stores are gonna close today but hopefully I can take everything tomorrow morning again really unfortunate but I guess that's just the process of furniture and shipping and all that stuff I guess we'll do this another day in the meantime I'm gonna try and put away and organize what I do have at least make it go away somehow okay guys so we've been setting up my dresser sorry I haven't really shown behind the scenes I'm in the middle of finals week at this same exact time we got all this going on right here this is the console table the entry table that I had um, that I got from Wayfair but it came chipped on both corners of the tabletops so it's a bummer because everything seems to be going wrong every time I order something but it's okay because Wayfair has good customer service and they're sending replacements for the tabletop only it should be fine it should get here by the end of the week but now we're building the drawers and we're gonna put it in it looks so good I would show you guys the rest of my room but it's literally a hot mess right now like we got all this stuff that I have to put into the dresser oh I didn't show you guys the replacement I got I've been slacking a little on the vlog but we'll get back to it it's because everything's a little unorganized so I'm a little uncomfortable showing it on camera, you know, but that's a part of the process So I'm gonna do a separate video for my closet a separate video for my makeup and yeah, but it's all a process Hey you guys good morning. So today I'm so excited because my couch is finally coming So I got my couch on offer up I got a really good deal for it and they're coming to deliver it and assemble it So I take something off my chest, but unfortunately I'm not going to be filming them just because I don't want to like be all up in their business and stuff like that But my rug also came I got two rugs from overstock and I also got a really good deal on those as well So I'm excited to show you guys everything everything's piecing together. I'm getting a lot of pieces from Wayfair and stuff like that. So I will show you guys once they are here and once the couch is set up. It is such a bomb couch. I can't wait for you guys to see. So yesterday I went to Ross. Sorry, I've kind of been sucking at vlogging. I kind of just randomly go to the store and then when I see stuff, I get it. I got this painting. I love it so much. It is huge. I got it for $60. I originally was going to put it on this wall, but I actually think I'm going to put it on the kitchen wall and it's really cloudy today, so excuse all the, the lighting, but also at Ross, I got this insane mirror for only 20 freaking dollars. I don't even know why it was this cheap and I don't know why it's blurry. Everything under my dresser is a mess. I did the Marie Kondo folding technique on my jeans over here And then all of the rest of these are empty I actually have to figure out because I got some crystal knobs Which let me show you guys that before I forget I got these crystal knobs on Amazon So I think me and my boo are gonna drill these in before I put anything in there And then from home goods I showed you guys I got this lazy Susan at Ross They had these candles. I also got a tall one, but that one's missing for some reason I think it fell out in my car I'll see and I don't know why my camera barely focuses that's annoying I think it's time for a replacement so then the bed I have these pillows bed frame still looking the same I need to get a new comforter but the problem is this is an off white color this is like a cream color and then we have the gray so the white sheets with the bed I honestly don't like how it looks at all I think it makes the bed look kind of like stained for some reason so I wanted to get like a light gray comforter set maybe so I feel like it's really tricky to make it look good with the walls and like the color scheme but Amazon doesn't really have any good ones and I think I'm gonna have to get a big duvet and then a duvet cover so that's gonna come out to like $200 and honestly everything is hella expensive all at once so I'm probably gonna wait on little things like that and different other accessories that I need just because gotta save some coin too then we got the jewelry I'm gonna set this up for you guys it's hard to open but this is what it's looking like i'm so excited i'm gonna set this up later for you guys and i'm gonna show you got some earrings some bracelet holders necklace holders this is the necklace that one of y'all made for me thank you so much her company name is ayw create i have to also get triple a batteries i keep forgetting because they have led lights that go right here and then little drawers and stuff for the past three years my jewelry has all been in this one drawer from the alex five drawers like are you serious like i have my sunglasses every single accessory so to be honest that's why you don't really see me wearing accessories that often because i've always had to dig through this so i'm really excited to do this later and to organize so this way i could see all of my accessories right there really exciting everything's a mess i still need to wait on dollar tree is sold out of the organizers i need so the makeup this is so stressful but hopefully by 
April, mid-April, this will all be done out of the way. I was trying to take things out of my nightstands. This nightstand, unfortunately, has got to go. I'm going to get two of the same ones from Ikea for each side of the bed. So I'm trying to figure out what's going to go in what. So this is how the couch looks like all set up. Look how stunning it is. And look at the freaking rug. Ignore those old sheets, but... This goes perfectly. This is approximately five foot by seven foot rug. This is the couch. It's this white leather. It looks so good. And then that right there, I do not like how that looks at all. It doesn't look good in that corner or that corner, but I really want to keep it. I'm trying to figure out what to do. So for now, this is just staying there, especially because the Wi-Fi hook is right there. So I'm going to figure that out. The AC, the couch looks so good. And I also got another one of these rugs, which is the runner version for the entrance. I have some textbooks on it right now, but you guys get the point um, I'm just trying to flatten it and this is the old rug that I had that I just put outside the door so then from Wayfair I got a console table and I also got this mirror if you guys remember when I did my birthday shoot I bought this mirror to also go in the entrance so I'm gonna hang that on the wall but for most apartments I don't know if it's like this for your apartment but for mine we're not technically supposed to hang things on the wall but it's kind of impossible not to especially with like earthquakes and stuff so me and my man are gonna figure that out go to Home Depot and see like what we can do in terms of like drilling into the wall and stuff but thanks to my boo me and him have been building a lot of stuff lately he's been helping me a lot he built my dresser as you guys saw we got some bathroom organization so I don't even know if I showed you guys what was in the bathroom before oh we had this basic ugly Tupperware and also a really ugly rack that was right here and I hated it every single day and I couldn't stand it every day. I finally hung my painting up right here. This is the cute organizer from Wayfair. Unfortunately, it is really narrow, which is a good thing because here's the pass into my room, but I can't fit towels on it or anything. I got this from Home Goods. How cute is it? And for now, I just have Q-tips and cotton rounds in there. And then I organized this a little bit. How to have more work and then this we also built it's gonna go above the toilet super cute and i also got this uh trash bin from home goods super cute so yeah and then i don't know if i also showed you i got filtered shower head but i also want to get rid of this and get like a corner organizer and then this is the shower curtain it actually was way too long so since this is like older shower and it has like this you i had to get an extra wide shower curtain so there wasn't many options on amazon but i actually really like this one but it came super long as well so i went to the tailor and got that fixed up but yeah and then also from ross and home goods a mix of both i got the blankets are from home goods and these pillows are from ross i wanted to get more pillows but nothing was kind of fitting the vision even these i'm kind of iffy on they look really cute but i don't know i kind of wanted like a darker gray like a design so i kind of want to look online to see for better decorative pillows but these blankets i thought they would go really well with the different grays in the carpet and i want to get like a little basket thing to go behind the couch to store everything so yeah a lot of updates a work in progress from here on out it's pretty much all about organizing this weekend i want to try and tackle the kitchen to go to container store and finally be able to use the kitchen also i have my big bean bag right now it just has a bunch of laundry that i have to do because as you can see my dresser situation is a mess so i wanted to keep it on here but i am gonna unfortunately throw this out because there's just no room for it in this corner i'm gonna end up getting i think like an l-shaped desk because i'm gonna need it for something you guys will see so now i'm honestly going to set my jewelry there's gonna be a lot to organize but i can't wait hey guys okay so i'm on glam right now i just filmed the intro um today was a picture taking day and yeah so i'm gonna do some other things today i'm gonna go to container store um what else home depot because we want to get some uh, concrete nails to try and put them in the walls because these are not drywall i still have to organize i have yet to do my jewelry as well so We'll save that for the next video. But yeah, it's just a process and sitting down. Honestly, when it comes to my dresser, go sit on the couch. Actually, the lighting is the other way, so. When it comes to my dresser, I think I'm not gonna film that because I'm a night person. I work a lot during the night, so during the night, I'm just gonna like go through all the clothes, pick what I want, what I don't want, and put that away, and then the lighting 
in there isn't that great in the nighttime. So when I do my organization series, I'm planning on showing you guys my makeup organization, my closet, and then I'll keep you guys updated with the furniture vlog. So the next furniture vlog, we're gonna work on more finishing touches, decoration, a few more other pieces. I just got the notification that the Wayfair other parts are gonna come at the end of the week. But yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye everyone.